Climate change is a major global challenge. As a key solution for climate change and as a major contributor towards achieving carbon neutrality by 2050, hydrogen is attracting worldwide attention. Access to clean energy worldwide requires the development of a global hydrogen transportation network with the capacity to produce and transport hydrogen over long distances on an industrial scale. Chioda are focusing on metal cyclohexane, or MCH, as a hydrogen carrier to safely transport hydrogen from supply to demand countries at ambient temperature and pressure using existing vessels such as chemical tankers. In this hydrogen supply chain, MCH is initially produced by uniting hydrogen and toluene in the supply country for transportation overseas. Gaseous hydrogen is extracted from the MCH through dehydrogenation in the demand country using the key component for realizing a commercially viable chain. Chioda successfully developed dehydrogenation catalyst. Let's further analyze the dehydrogenation process. Gaseous MCH from the vaporizer is separated into hydrogen and toluene as it flows from the top of the catalyst-filled reaction tube to the bottom. After cooling, gaseous hydrogen is extracted and liquid toluene is captured as the byproduct. Chioda's proprietary catalyst is the pivotal constituent for this sustained and stable dehydrogenation process. The recycled toluene is shipped back to the supply country to be reunited with hydrogen for further production of MCH in the final stage of a closed loop. Because MCH is a chemically stable liquid under ambient conditions, Existing petroleum and petrochemical infrastructure can be used for its safe and economical storage and transportation under existing international standards and regulations. We have developed this supply chain system using our proprietary MCH technology and named the system Spera Hydrogen. Since developing our proprietary dehydrogenation catalyst in 2002, Chioda's challenge has been the realization of a carbon-free hydrogen society. Spera Hydrogen, hope for the future of energy.